Welcome back, this video will hopefully show you how to solve the error when trying to install a Windows update. If your Windows doesn't automatically update or receives an error encountered message when you try to manually update it, then at least one of these solutions should work. Remember to hit the like button and subscribe if this video helps, we're closing in on 2000 subscribers, so any help would be greatly appreciated. Firstly, we need to double check that there is an issue with the updates. Navigate to the updates page by searching for updates in the search bar. If this page allows you to search for updates then try that. It could be that it hasn't been searching automatically. If you're on this video though, I would imagine this probably won't work. The first of the two solutions is to troubleshoot the error. Windows has a good chance of finding and fixing the error itself. Search troubleshoot in the search bar to get to the troubleshoot page then find where it says Windows Update. Click on this and allow the troubleshooter to run. In my experience this can take quite a while so feel free to minimize it whilst it runs. The troubleshooter should find an issue and if it does it will say that it has been fixed automatically. You can then try searching for and installing the updates again using the same method I mentioned at the start of the video. If the troubleshooter couldn't find an error or if the fix didn't make a difference then the next solution should help. On a side note, this is what had occurred to me and although the first fix didn't work, this next one sorted it. Head to the link in the description and near the top of the page you should see a mention to an update. In my case it is currently the October 2018 update. This is an official Microsoft Windows page so you don't need to worry about any fake pop-ups or anything like that. It will download the Windows Update Assistant. Once the download is completed, you'll need to run the program. You will need administrator privileges for this to work, as you'll get the dialog box asking for permission to make changes to your PC. As with most Windows programs, it's easy to follow. Just allow the updates to install. It will take a while, as it has to both download and install the updates, and you may need to restart your PC as well. It also might appear to freeze at a certain percentage, but it just takes its time, so it might be best to leave it running whilst you're away. And that's it, I hope this video helped, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe if either of the solutions work. If you have any other questions or video requests, then just leave a comment and I'll respond as soon as I can. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in another video.